Chicago, can you please stay? Oh, sorry. No, go ahead. Go ahead. If, if, if everyone who has just testified, if you could stay around, if you can stay around, that'd be great. We'll, we'll have questions for you in a few minutes. But please. All right, I'm Elwood Ahu. My number is 3391. Thank you uh, for allowing us to speak and to share. I've had a chance to listen to the conversations around the building for the last couple of days, and um, I find that this debate is not about marriage. It's not about benefits. It's not about equality. It's about people who are trying to be heard on both sides. Proponents are claiming that they haven't been heard, but they're, and they're being recognized as second-class citizens. The opponents of the bill are crying out that they've already voted, and no one's listening. So both are simply trying to be heard. And I'm so thankful that we live in the USA, which has the best system in the world that can resolve such issues, and that system is called democracy. The system that promotes a process of equal treatment and fairness so that, regardless of the outcome, the winners and the losers will feel that they've had their fair shake. In the playground, uh, democracy was simplified as simple junk in a poll. I've spent my years uh, in my career as a circuit court judge and in the judicial system. You have a trial that, where both sides can be heard and an impartial judge and an impartial jury will decide. And my role as a judge was to ensure that both parties were treated fairly, that the counsel on both sides was treated fairly. But most of all, I thought my responsibility was to protect the process. The process became more important than the results. And in the legislature, it's no different. When the process is implemented and designed, the parties are treated fairly, and they will respect the result. When the process is honored, united we stand. When the process is dishonored, divided we fall. And in this case, the process was not honored. That's why I stand in opposition to SB1. And it's not the process that the House has taken. I fully respect and I, and I appreciate the process you've taken. The process as a whole, we've heard many unanswered questions, and we're rushing through the process. My time is up. Sorry. Thank you very much. Next up.